you did into the sea of forgetfulness. Amen. Come on, say that's his will. That is his will. See, he willed to not only um, forgive us for what we said, but for the very acts that we did. Amen. Come on here, amen. amen. So when he forgives us, he forgives us deeply. He, he forgives us of the whole thing. Amen. Come on here. Nothing. No residuals. Do y'all understand that? Amen. So God says he took it. Got to remember that. Amen. 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 Remember God took it. Come on, Amen. say it with me. Say God took it. God, God took, took it. it. Amen. <clears throat> when we look at Romans 8, it says, Likewise, the Spirit also helpeth. Amen. 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 That word help means to come alongside and to assist. Do y'all hear me? Mm -hmm. Amen. He helpeth our infirmities. Now, a lot of times what we've done is, is that we took that word infirmities and we made it physical sickness. Mm. Amen. That's Come true. Here. Amen. We made it to mean he took our physical sickness. Amen. A lot of times we, we, we're quoting that scripture over physical ailments. Yes. But you got to understand that his word, what he did on Calvary's cross, penetrated greater than just the physical sickness. Amen. Come on here. Amen. He he penetrated and he accomplished more on Calvary's cross more than just ensuring that you're going to get to heaven to the Amen. great by and by. Amen. Come on here. Amen. He came to make you whole. Amen. Amen. Then he was when he was at the pool of Bethesda. Mm -hmm. The Bible says the man laid there what some 38 Amen. years. Amen. Come on here. Amen. 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 He laid there. Amen. And when Jesus saw him, he was in pitiful shape, wasn't he? Amen. Come on here. Amen. And he asked him a question. Will you be made whole? Come on here. And he says, Lord, I would. But when the water is, when the angel comes to stir the water, you know, the first one that gets in, that's the one that's healed. And God said, that's not what I'm asking you. Amen. Jesus. Amen. 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 And God says to us tonight, are you tired? Come on here. Come on now. Of, of, of your ways. Are you tired of this reoccurring situation? Are you yeah. tired of being hurt? Come on here. Amen. Are you tired of turning them over to Jesus? Amen. Are you tired, amen, that I'm going to forgive, but I ain't going to forget? Are you tired, come on here, of them sleepless night and them red pills? Come on here. Amen. Are we tired? Yes. Amen. Because, see, are you tired of being a wounded warrior? Amen. 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 We, 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 we fashion ourselves. You know, I'm, I'm a wounded warrior. I got my battle scars. Come on here. So what? Jesus already paid the price. Amen. Your battle scars will be nothing in comparison Amen. to what he did. Amen. He says we must come to the point. Come on here. Yes. As he did when he was on Calvary's cross. Yes. Amen. He said this to me. He said, he said to them, Father, forgive them. For they know not what they do. Come on here. We got to come to that point. So I'm taking you over to Jesus. I'm going to forgive you, but I ain't going to forget. And every time you think about it, you crying and you rehearsing it. He says, we got to come to that place in him. Amen. You know, I forgive them. Amen. That's it. Not only do I forgive you, but I forgive, but I forgive what? You do. You did. I forgive you deeply. Amen. Mm. Amen. Come on here. Because he, he says to us, he says, as far as the east yeah. is from the west, he don't remember it. Amen. So, by the way, I remember yesterday when you crossed your eyes at me. Jesus. Come on here. I remember. Did you see that? And, and God says, I remember when they hurt me. And come on here, y'all. And God says, when do you let it go? Amen. That's it. When do we come to the understanding that he took it? Yes. Come on, lift your hands and say he took it. He, he took, took it. it. Amen. You got to mean it. He took it. He, he so if he took it. he took it, then why do we still 
has it. That's it. Jesus. Come on here. Why are we still? Come on here. We 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 running from this place to that place. We're looking for a word. Come on here, y'all. The church needs more words than I ever seen in my life. And don't do nothing with that one. Amen. Amen. Looking for somebody else to pray us through, break us through. Come on here, somebody. Amen. Amen. Shift us through. Shift. Amen. Amen. And he says the problem is, come on here, amen, is that while we're hollering shift, that person's will got to come into place and say, I shift. Amen. Come on here. That person's will got to come into place and say, you know what? I forgive them. I let this go for real. Amen. Come on here. Amen. Come on, say, God took it. God, God took it. it. So you got to remember that. He took it. Amen. Amen. So if he took it, I don't have to have it. Amen. Does this make sense? Amen. 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 Come on, say it. Lord, I thank you. Lord, I thank you. For healing me. For healing me. Amen. So as we begin to look at this, he says, he himself took it. He himself took our infirmities. And it also says in Romans 8 and 26, Holy Spirit helps us. I like the King James Version because it's got the E-T-H on it, which means to he the continues. point of continuation. That's yeah. it. In other words, he going to help you till you, you make it through. Come on. Amen. 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 Lord, deliver me. Come on, get delivered. Come on now. <laughs> Amen. Lord, I want to get saved. Get, get saved. Amen. That's it. Lord, I want to love them. Love me. Come on. Amen. Come on here. Just we have to understand that we have a part in this. And what I hear, even the church, come on here in this day. God, if you just do it, He says, But what's your part in it? What you gonna do? That's it. I just want you to, to help me to, to overcome, and I just want you, amen, to just break me through. He says, Okay, but what you doing to be broken through? Where's your prayer life at? Come on. Amen. How much are you letting go of? Amen. Lord, I just, I just want you to, to do it for me. Do it, Jesus. Do it, do it, do it. He says, okay, when you when you come into agreement. Amen. See, what we've done is we put all this whole responsibility and we expect God to do it and we have no part in it. Mm, help us, Jesus. Amen. Didn't I tell you I don't get mad with me? Amen. 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 God said, so what's your part is? Where you, where you, 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 you praying? Amen. Are you believing me? Amen. Come on here. Amen. That's it. Are you, are you applying mercy? Are you amen. still waiting on them sacrifices? Amen. God says, you, you know, just because you give don't mean, amen, you get a, a, a free exit. Come on here. You better say that one now. You amen. give till you, till you blew in the face. Amen. But if you don't get this heart right, come on here. All amen. your giving is in vain. Yes. Yeah. And we think just because we good tie payers. Yeah. Oh boy. I don't know why I went there. Come on. Yeah. You think just because, amen, I give up myself, God, I'm giving myself away till I get home. Amen. amen. That's it. Come on here. He says, I can't heal you because you won't play your part in it. Amen. Wow. Amen. Amen. I was sharing, and I said, you know what? You know, a lot of times we cry and we say, God, you know, I just want to lose weight, but we're still eating them bum bums. Uh, <laughs> and, and we testify and say, ooh, God, go help me lose 50 pounds. And then we go eat bum bums. <laughs> go eat a pack of cinnamon rolls. That. that don't make sense, does it? It's unbalanced. So let's look at this. Amen. He wants us healed. Look at somebody and say, God wants you healed. God wants you healed. So he said, what is woundedness? He says, woundedness is when one experiences a trial and holds on to the pain and anger instead of surrendering it to God. Oh, wow. That's when woundedness come in. You know why? Because, see, the devil told you that you had the right to be angry. Come on here. He told you that just because you got raped eight years ago, that it's okay, come on here, for now for you to to uh to move into negative emotions and negative mindsets. Amen. 
Come on here. Amen. Hmm? Oh, woundedness is when a person experiences a trial. You go through something. They go through something. Go through through something. something. You go through something and you hold on to the pain instead of surrendering it to God. Amen. Amen. So what we do is...